This is Matt from Gadzilla.org, and today is an unboxing of the Nokia 6210 Navigator. Uh, big big thanks to my buddies over at Overseas Electronics. Uh, we'll post a link in the uh, video for them. Uh, go check them out. Uh, thanks for getting me the 6210 review. So let's get to the unboxing today. Um, this is a pretty neat phone. Uh, it's got actual true... Um, uh, magnetic compass in here so with the GPS you actually turn the phone and uh, the map orientates itself to whichever way the phone is pointing. So this is a 6210. Uh, from what I understand I think they make two different variants. They make the European band and the US band so this does not have 3G but from what I understand they do have a 3G US version so we'll take a look at that later hopefully. Uh, but this is a 6210 navigator slider form factor uh, in red 3.2 megapixel autofocus camera with the uh, Xeon lens a uh, bunch of uh, navigation buttons up here we'll talk about that later uh, in the upcoming reviews and standard keypad there on the side here we have uh, these aren't rubber doors anymore these are actually flip doors a uh, mini USB I don't know if you can make that out on the camera that's for the mini USB accessories, uh, micro SD slot. Now it's nice, the headphone jack on top, but the charging port on top as well. From what I can tell, Nokia still has not changed their mind in charging through the USB mini port, so separate charger and separate port. But overall, the device is really nice. On the right side, we have the camera button and volume rocker. Take a look at that. And let's take a look at the rest of the box here. The usual Nokia goodies. Right, headphone, battery, charger, or sorry, USB cable, not charger. And the typical manuals and the other goodies. And like I said, this guy is the Navigator series, so it does have built-in GPS. And then here's some information about uh, getting six months free of maps with that and just a good old charger in there. So let's power it up and let's take a look at it. So on the back here it's a little it's a little odd but this is like most Nokia phones. The back is a little tough to get off so you gotta muscle it off gently. doesn't feel like there's any juice in it, but I'll post another video with the power on and uh, some pictures of it, and stay tuned to Gadzilla.org for the review in the coming days, and thanks for coming by. Again, this is the Nokia Navigator 6210.